Hey everyone, this is Kelly from House of Virgo. I wanted to just leave you some very special messages for tonight as I will not be able to do a live stream tonight, but I wanted to leave you with something for the month of May. I was feeling called to give you some special messages from Madame Andorra's deck here. So give me just a minute here so I can to it, these messages that are coming through. Okay. In your career, I'm, I'm hearing there's something here with your career, your plans, your projects, things that you are hoping to achieve at this time. You are destined to succeed. You have the talisman here. Um, Whatever you're trying to accomplish at this time, your thoughts, your ideas, um, there's something here, uh, even if it's like school, if you're trying to attend school or thinking about that, uh, a new job, or um, thinking about uh, trying to create something, make your income and your finances grow or become more, more stable, I do get a sense here that Whatever you're planning to do in the month of May, this is going to be, you'll be very successful. It's like in the cards, it's destiny here. Um, and some of you have something very unique that I'm hearing that you, um, either you're working on or you have a, some type of, something that's been done but improved upon, some kind of new idea that not anybody else has ever seen before. If this is something that you are, thinking of doing or you're you're just kind of not sure how it's going to go or how it will be received or if you are blending some ideas together i do feel like you're, you're going to be really taking off with this people are going to notice this whatever you're trying to do and you're going to be recognized it's it's like it's in the cards something new it, it, i'm feeling like setting some kind of new trend Okay, let's see. Okay. So you have the shield. So you are safe from harm. So you also have something going on here in your life where this is a protective energy. And I feel like the message here is you need to know that you are, um, you are safe. You're being protected by the angels. Uh, there's a guardian, there's somebody watching over you. Um, it could be an ancestor or someone that has passed away is watching over you at this time. So you're being shielded. If you have any fears or there's something that, um, there, there's a, I'm feeling something like a, a fear to step out or put your toe in the water or take a step here um, because of fear of backlash or something possibly going on in your life where some you, you feel threatened the message here with the shield is that you are safe and you don't have to you don't have to be afraid you don't have to have fear something that you could be needing to go out on a limb with you're safe nothing's going to hurt you nothing's going to harm you Okay, you've got the gate here. So this is a message that there may be some type of a barrier that's keeping you from your goal. What is this barrier? It could be fear. Going out on a limb, setting a trend, doing something different. And I feel like all of this is kind of connected in some way because there's a, a fear of a backlash. It could be doing going against a family. Um, expectations are going against it feels like a kind of rebellious energy but for the right reasons okay it, it's something original and creative okay and there's a fear of authority or people places or things telling you that you can't do something or that you shouldn't do something whether this is career or this could be in, in your, your love relationships or your health, you have a barrier and I feel like that barrier is, it's fear, but it's also too much of a shield. 
can keep you from can cover you so much that it could keep you from actually breaking I'm hearing breaking out somebody's needing to breaking to break out of a situation all right let me see here what other messages for you Virgo okay you have the green men so the forces of nature favor you you know this kind of feels like um some of you are trying or thinking of doing something with cbd or um marijuana <laughs> um but this is something to do with nature here give me a second here something to do with nature favoring you in a, in a particular situation all right I'm just kind of looking here at this this that, because I haven't read this book yet but I have to tell you that um, the first thing that was coming to me is something to do keeping it green oh that's what they're saying keeping it green here um, don't forget, I'm feeling like don't forget where you come from, where your idea or your plan is coming from. This is super, super important for you in order to, that, that's what keeps this thing or whatever this is that you're doing original. <clears throat> this is what keeps it original. This is what's going to be the thing that changes everything there's something to do with with an outdoor being outdoors doing something outdoors coming for some of you it's just coming out of being in hermit mode for a long time and waking up and coming out uh, kind of like um, I feel like somebody uh, you've been hiding maybe you've become very introverted and hiding and having a fear of coming back out into your life doing something differently breaking out it feels I'm feeling very strong like um, the full energy having fresh hope taking some kind of a chance and a risk there's a new path before you, especially in the month of May, <clears throat> an adventure of some sort. And it's there's a fear, and that's why they're telling you that you are safe from harm or even your own self-sabotaging ways here. But you've got this barrier, and this is a barrier that there's really no other way around it but through it. Okay, serendipity bright new prospects are on the horizon this is beautiful this is like the other side of the gate here it's so um a little scary i feel for you to step out because there's unknown you don't know how in your mind you don't know how something is going to go you don't know how it's going to turn out do you take that risk or do you just stay where you are but then you feel stagnant and like this isn't satisfying enough for you. But I'm feeling like you're going to succeed. And whenever you're, once you get through this gate, once you get past this barrier, then it will be on. Then things are going to change greatly. All these um, new prospects, the, these bright new ideas, are gonna, things are just going to start moving. Okay, you have the chimera. Imagination clouds your judgment. So you're overthinking. Magical thinking clouds your judgment here. Keep it real. Take it step by step, moment by moment. Okay, you've got the siren. The temptation may lead you astray. And I feel like um, you have to stay grounded with this decision that you're making or this choice to go forward. <clears throat> Don't be led astray by anything that will take you off your path or anything that will keep you um, stuck. Temptation actually might be keeping you stuck as well. 
The siren can represent um, the siren represents some kind of sweet, immediate release that in the long run will not serve you. So it's kind of like um, there's an there's a vision of grandeur here. I want it now. I'm hearing. I want it now. And that's part of the imagination where it's too much of that energy can keep you keep you where you are. In other words, some of you might like if I were to use an analogy, what they're giving me is like a diet, for example, if you're cutting out sugar and then you tell yourself, well, you know, just this one little bit won't won't hurt but you're really trying to break through into something new. And I'm just using this example. I mean, it could resonate for you, but you're really trying to break into something new, something different, different for you. And you, there is a possibility that you could fall back, fall backwards if you become enchanted by something. A captivating stimulus may incite foolish risk. Resist temptation. Voice your desires. So whatever this situation is here for you, and I don't know exactly who I'm speaking to, but whatever this situation is here for you, it's really important for you to take a look at what your, your barriers and your obstacles are and what you need to overcome. Even if it's fear-induced, what you need to overcome, you will be able to do that. But don't be in a place of over-imagination where you fool yourself, get get grounded, have re speak in reality, go out into nature, speak to nature, because the the nat nature naturalistic forces here are favoring you whatever you need so if for some of you it could just have something to do with just getting back out there again is what i'm hearing getting back out there again is very important for your health okay you've got winds of change your surroundings are undergoing transition here absolutely so whether this is on the love front the material front in your life the emotional front the physical the intellect your thoughts your creativity there's very strong messages here that you very well could be your biggest obstacle. That no one else and nothing else is holding you back except for your, your thoughts and your fears. And once you rearrange your thoughts and your fears, put things into perspective, pass through that gate knowing that you are protected and you are safe, that you will reach the ultimate success, which with what the message here that you're trying to get to and you've got the queen love and prosperity so this feels more like a message of hope that things will actually begin there's light at the end of the tunnel here and you just have to go through it there's no really other way to get to that light you can't go around it below it above it you have to actually go through it when you're ready to take that step, I feel like the reassurance here is that that love and prosperity is what is waiting for you. That is what will envelop you. So I hope you take this message and I hope that it, it applies or you're able to apply it to a particular area of your life or whatever is going on in your life at this time. It feels like a very special message for someone very special. I hope it helps and I will see you guys very soon. Take care.